Tonight, Stephen, this is the first meeting since this case was brought against a contractor in a case based here in Macomb Township. Now, last month I interviewed the township supervisor. Tonight, she said nothing, but what she said to me a couple of weeks ago has a lot of people out here upset, and take a look at why. This happened under your watch? Yes. How did it happen? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You run this place, don't you? I try, but I have a lot of people that help me. She's reacting to Chris Sorrentino, charged by the feds with doing a no-work job, getting paid, and then paying a kickback of $66,000 to an unnamed Macomb Township official. Township records show he did two no-bid jobs and was paid more than a half million dollars. Sources say the elected official paid those bribes, Dino Bucci, who's also accused of soliciting bribes in another civil lawsuit that's still pending. Residents tonight blasting Bucci and Dunn. This community has lost confidence. They've lost confidence in you. How did the township supervisor or township trustee not notice this? Were the five of you receiving kickbacks from Sorrentino? Both Miss Dunn and Mr. Bucci, you guys need to resign today. Or will you be the next Miss Dunn on the FBI interview table? I suggest or uh, would be pleased if you would stand up and resign, or at least step down until these acquisitions and allegations about the federal probe are resolved. The board also started discussing bringing in an outside auditor to examine how the township bid process works and if it's legit and if people are disciplined. The new township clerk says she tried to investigate the Fed's case and could not find out how things went wrong. Something went wrong on more than one occasion with our bid process that allowed for criminal accusations out there. Now the board's going to look at the cost of an auditor at the next meeting in a couple of weeks. Tonight, Dino Bucci made no comments to this crowd. He's not charged with any crimes, but Chris Sorrentino is set to make a plea deal with the feds. Maybe within a couple of weeks, he will be their star witness. Live in Macomb Township, Jim Kurtzner, 7 Action News.